At the 2024 KDEX International Defense Exhibition, a landmark agreement was signed between Poland's WB Group and South Korea's Hanwha Aerospace to form a joint venture focused on producing CGR-080 missiles for Poland's Homar-K artillery systems. This partnership not only deepens the defense cooperation between the two nations but also bolsters Poland's defense industry, positioning it for greater self-sufficiency in military production. The collaboration builds on existing ties, as South Korea has already deployed CGR-080 missiles on its K-239 Chunmu launchers and acquired Warmate 3 loitering munitions, produced by Poland's WB Group. With Poland's modernization efforts in full swing, this new joint venture is set to play a crucial role in Poland's artillery transformation. The agreement, signed on October 2, 2024, in the presence of Poland's Deputy Minister of National Defense, Pawel Bejda, and South Korea's Defense Acquisition Program Administration, DAPA, Representative Cho Hyun Ki, signifies a pivotal moment in the defense partnership between Poland and South Korea. The deal includes the establishment of a new manufacturing facility in Poland, capable of producing several thousand CGR-080 missiles annually. While the location of this facility is yet to be determined, it will be critical in supporting Poland's acquisition of over 200 Homar-K launchers. The establishment of local missile production is part of Poland's broader strategy to enhance its defense capabilities, ensuring a consistent and reliable supply of advanced munitions for the Polish armed forces. This shift towards domestic production reflects Poland's strategic focus on military self-reliance, reducing dependency on foreign suppliers and increasing its defense industry's resilience. Poland's artillery modernization program reached a significant milestone in August 2024 with the initial delivery of Homar-K systems to the 1st Masaryan Artillery Brigade of the 16th Mechanized Division. The Homar-K is a long-range artillery system inspired by the U.S. HMARS, but produced locally through international partnerships, including the integration of Hanwha Aerospace's K-239 Chunmu launchers. Mounted on Jelk's P882.57 TST45 KMRS 8x8 chassis, the system provides Poland with state-of-the-art firepower. The Homar-K system's modular design allows it to fire a combination of 12 guided 239mm rockets with an 80km range or long-range ballistic missiles that can strike targets up to 290km away. This adaptability makes it a strategic asset for Poland, enabling it to engage targets over a wide operational range, reinforcing Poland's defensive and offensive capabilities in the region. Poland's artillery modernization efforts are part of a comprehensive plan to replace outdated Soviet-era systems like the BM-21 Grad. The acquisition of 288 K-239 Chunmu launchers was formalized through an agreement signed in October 2022 between Poland's Armament Agency and Hanwha Aerospace. An additional deal in April 2024 expanded this purchase to include 72 more launchers by 2029, bringing the total to 290 units. This steady phase deployment ensures Poland's artillery forces will have modern high-performance systems to meet current and future security needs. Mounted on the rugged Jelks 8x8 truck, the Homar K system provides enhanced mobility, a crucial feature for implementing shoot and scoot tactics. These tactics enable artillery units to quickly fire and reposition, minimizing their exposure to enemy counterattacks. Additionally, the system integrates with the Topaz combat management platform, along with Fonit and Radmore digital communication systems. This networked capability ensures that Poland's forces can coordinate with NATO command and control structures, aligning their operations with broader alliance strategies. The CGR-080 missile, designed for the Homar K, is optimized to deliver precision strikes at ranges of up to 80 kilometers. The new joint venture between WB Group and Hanwha Aerospace will focus on producing the 239mm variant of these missiles supporting the Homar KS operational requirements. The establishment of a dedicated production facility in Poland will ensure a consistent supply of munitions for the Polish military, enhancing both strategic resilience and logistical efficiency. The facility is expected to become operational within the next two years, pending the finalization of funding. Once completed, this project will be a major step forward in Poland's goal of achieving military self-sufficiency, allowing it to meet its own munitions needs while also providing opportunities for export and collaboration with other allied nations. This new initiative underscores Poland's commitment to strengthening its national defense capabilities while advancing its domestic defense industry. By partnering with Hanwha Aerospace, a leading South Korean defense manufacturer, Poland not only gains access to advanced technologies but also positions itself as a key player in the regional defense market. 
The joint venture supports research, development, and production activities that are integral to Poland's long-term defense strategy. Moreover, the successive deliveries of Homar-K systems, combined with local missile production, mark a significant step in Poland's artillery transformation. As the country prepares to meet future security challenges in Eastern Europe, its investments in modern defense infrastructure and partnerships with international allies are setting the stage for a more robust and resilient military force. In conclusion, the joint venture between WB Group and Hanwha Aerospace is more than just a manufacturing agreement. It represents a strategic alliance that will shape the future of Poland's defense industry and military capabilities for years to come. As Poland continues to modernize and strengthen its armed forces, partnerships like these will play a crucial role in ensuring the country's security and defense readiness in an increasingly complex global landscape.